I bet you won't be able to guess how many water molecules are in this glass. So here's a quick Fermi challenge for you, smarty pants. How many water Ow. Hey, VT! Well, hi, Mark. What are you doing here? I can estimate the number of water molecules in that glass. Oh, can you? Just bring it a little closer to camera. Uh, okay. Okay. And now how tall are you? 160 centimeters on a good day. Yeah. Wait, what does that have to well, do? Your hand length's about 10% of your height. So that should be a standard glass holding about 300 milliliters of water. And water weighs one gram per milliliter. So that should be about 300 grams. And water being H2O has two hydrogens and one oxygen. That makes each molecule weighing about 18 grams per mole. Exactly. So 300 grams of water is about 16.7 moles. Now multiply that by my favorite number in chemistry, Avogadro's number. So that gives us, give or take, 10 septillion molecules of water in that one glass, which by the way is a one followed by 25 zeros. And you beat spot on if this were just a normal glass of water and not half full of water beads. Ah, of course, water beads. They have the same index of refraction of water, meaning they disappear when you submerge them. That was a very dirty trick, VT. Checking your mail for a thank you glitter bomb. And donate to Team Water. <sighs> we tricked my crowbar.